Patrick Bourny from France drive these crazy trucks. Steve Murty from Britain specializes in a different kind of truck madness. He has the record for the longest ever wheelie in a truck, an unbeaten quarter of a mile. But it's tough to beat your own record. This is the largest truck. This gigantic dump truck weighs over 200 tons. It's used to haul 320 tons of rock in open cast mining. It's 24 feet high and 27 feet wide. It needs power steering because the tires alone are over 12 feet high. There are 25 of these trucks around the world. They're shipped in parts because they're way too big for any highway to handle. Since the Second World War, over 50 million trucks have been built in the United States alone. Almost all the goods we use are at some stage transported by these giants of the road. Many other trucks work off highway, each designed for a specific job. They cope with the toughest conditions and the most inhospitable environments. These trucks are the workhorses of industry. They're built to be tough, and they're built to last. But there are people who use trucks for something entirely different. Steve also drives a much more powerful truck. This one has a 24,000 horsepower jet engine. It can reach 150 miles per hour in under a quarter of a mile. It's the fastest truck in Europe. But the fastest truck in the world is the Shockwave. This truck is powered by three Pratt & Whitney J48 jet engines, producing an incredible 36,000 horsepower. At full thrust, they develop four times more power than an F-14 jet fighter. and then shaved to an eighth of an inch thick. 
In 1992, Shockwave broke the land speed record for trucks. It reached 376 miles per hour. To cover events like air shows for television, you need a huge mobile control room. This is the Darth Vader, the most expensive truck and trailer in the world. It's worth $7 million. The 53-foot trailer expands to provide seating for up to 30 technicians who control the latest state-of-the-art digital television equipment. The trailer is pulled by a brand new Kenworth T2000. rig has to have a special permit because it's 75 feet it's three feet longer than any other truck on american roads also at 45 tons it needs a skillful driver the t2000's regular driver is sam rackham and he's very proud of his truck the aerodynamic styling is designed to increase fuel efficiency and the 12-liter engine is computer-controlled. The New York Fire Department relies on two different kinds of trucks. There are fire engines which pump water, and there are trucks which carry ladders. <laughs>
sometimes is a problem. Sometimes they don't see this big truck. That horns blaring, lights flashing. And sometimes the motorists, they don't yield. They claim they don't see you. So uh, you just got to be careful out there and have your wits about you. It's not just fires that we respond to, we uh, respond to emergency situations. We just try to, in general, to uh, you know, help the community out. This is just hitting the bottom. You guys all right?